Uh, Rick Viergever from the E-Foundation. Um, we make an uh, open source uh, variant of the Android open source project and uh, we run into many barriers and friction in doing so. Uh, one uh, thing that I wanted to mention today is uh, interrelated uh, inter to this discussion about uh, app stores. And it is that um, even if you manage to get the apps that you want on your, for example, Android operating system on your phone via whichever way, very often there are then barriers to using that software on your phone because, for example, many apps require proprietary solutions developed by Google. So my question is, will part of the work uh, in this area to make apps um, equally accessible in a fair way to European consumers, will it also include work to make sure that those apps actually work on the operating system on which they are installed? Um, or will we allow them to continue to not work because um, uh, they need proprietary solutions that cannot be copied by other operating systems in the market? Jan, you want to take that one? Yes, so, um, of course, without uh, being able to tell you exactly uh, how the Commission views this, <laughs> my view, as I expressed it, is that there should be equivalence of inputs. Um, so, to, and I'm, I'm sure you're alluding to Google Play services, potentially, uh, which uh, is needed uh, not, you know, as a side. It, it basically is a combination of the App Store and Google Play services. Um, so, in that case, uh, I would say Article 6.7 uh, would apply here too, in my understanding. At least it would be in my understanding useful if it would apply, um, because the, the idea is that there is competing apps that have the same kind of inputs being necessary. Um, what the legal stance on this is, I don't know, no? <laughs> because uh, the question is whether Google Play Services then, you know, is a core platform service in its own right or not, or whether it's part of the well, the App Store. Uh, but um, I guess this is also potentially being taken care of by Article 13, um, the anti-circumvention. Thanks a lot, Jan. Shall we take another online question?